My name is Rowan Barrett, okay? I'm the Director of Player Youth Development at Canada Basketball. One of my jobs is to go around the country and identify the talent that we have in our country. I never thought I'd miss you half as much as I do. The kids that we have that are coming up almost in every age group, when you look at their national rankings, their international rankings, uh, they're right at the top of the charts in terms of talent. You know, when I think about the next, you know, five or six years, the amount of players that we should be seeing making it all the way through, you know, even into the NBA, and, you know, the, the part and the role that Canada basketball can play in that, I'm very, very excited. I sat on this court actually many years ago and, uh, and went through the development stream that you're going through now. We won the national championships and all that and then into the junior national team for me and, and then our world university team into the world championships, into the Olympics. I captain Canada for many, many years. This is a very, very important part of your development. You get to come in with the other kids in your age group that are top in your age group and compete at that level. It's a good opportunity for us to identify who these players are. We're going to start looking at which one of you guys might be ready to start coming into our national team. Sometimes they're being pushed and driven harder than they've ever been before in their life. And they're starting to realize, wow, there's another level that I have. There's another gear that I have. There's more that I can do. And it's, it's just a, an amazing moment when you, when you look at a kid and you see the light bulb go off and you see a kid doing and accomplishing things that they never did before. So this is a talent identification session for Canada basketball, okay? You boys are 15 years old? 16, right? You guys are now coming to that time where, you know, we're looking at you very seriously now for our junior, our junior national team or our, our cadet team, right? So, so now we're looking at you and we want to understand what it is that you do and what we can do to help you to get to that next level. When I was younger than you, I started thinking about the Olympics. And I started thinking about what it would be like to represent my country. I believe it all starts with the dream. It starts with the vision, okay? So I want you to close your eyes. Can you imagine it? Take your greatest sporting experience and times it by 10, and you're starting to get into the area what you're gonna feel like. All right, open your eyes. These things are all achievable. They're all attainable. It all starts in your mind. Anyone on this earth that ever did anything great, it started here first. In terms of the talent that we have in Canada as compared to maybe our U.S. counterparts, you know, I think we're at the point now where uh, it's really hard to distinguish you know, between them. We have truly broken through and you, know, you see a player on the court, you, you, you won't know where he comes from. I think Canada basketball is in an enviable position of having so many players to choose from that uh, we're going to have to make some difficult decisions. I mean, when we start coming down the road to 2016 and that next Olympics, uh, conservatively speaking, I believe we'll have 15 to 16 NBA players, NBA drafted players to choose from. So in terms of the direction that we're going, it, the future looks very, very bright.
things. If you put in the time, you have the talent, and you work on the technique. These three things equal success. Success is different for some people. Some people want to make the MBA, some people just want to make it into university, some people just want to have a great experience and grow as a person. But I guarantee you, you put those three things together, they equal success. Keep the dream alive in your mind, whether it's 2016, maybe it's 2020. We've been in the Olympics once in the last 23 years. We want to go, right? We want to go. And, and our hopes are riding on some of you. All right? So let's keep the dream alive. Let's work at it. It starts now. cusp of something very, very, very special here in our country, and your country needs you.